13 states, District of Columbia, they've raised their minimum wages. Four more states are putting minimum wage initiatives on the ballot in November. And you know what? Here, here's the best part. You'll hear opponents, they'll say, well, minimum wage, they're going to kill jobs. Except it turns out the states where the minimum wage has gone up this year had higher job growth than the states that didn't raise the minimum wage. They're, that's the facts. But you know what? If I were looking for a good job that lets me build some security for my family, I'd join a union. If I were busting my butt in the service industry and wanted an honest day's pay for an honest day's work, I'd join a union. If I were a firefighter or a police officer risking my life and helping to keep my community safe and wanting to make sure I came home safely to my family, I'd join a union. When the rest of the country is working to open up more businesses, but Republicans in Congress block investments that would help more businesses grow, it ain't right. When unions and CEOs, when law enforcement and the evangelical community, when folks who usually don't agree on anything agree that we should be fixing our broken immigration system, but the Republicans in the House of Representatives have been sitting on a bill for more than a year, it ain't right.